Queen Anne's guy. Prince George and Dane preferred the idle way. They wed as an alliance to keep the Dutch at bay. Seventeen births and had all died, thus there was no heir. George passed on at fifty-five, tragic poor and to bear. Queen Caroline, consort to George the second, next in line, she could persuade while Paul and King George's thoughts to align. She had power of the king where George was overseas and battled her as strength and Frederick's evil tendencies. Charlotte, wife of George the Third, was next as consort. Fifteen children she would bore, raised with George's support. But his growing mental illness kept her from his side. Married fifty-seven years, till in eighteen she died. George the Fourth's Caroline lived a crude and boisterous life. He saw she was uncouth, so wanted to divorce his wife. She refused, but was barred from the coronated queen. She fell ill and in three weeks dead by suspicious means. For money, heirs, or peace, the monarchs marry. These the British royal consorts chronologically. Adelaide, William the Fourth's wife next to be consort. They tried, though sadly childless, William gave her more support. She kindly gave much of her income to charity and sadly tried at times to influence politically. Queen Victoria's Prince Albert consort through her reign Playing husband instead of head made him feel constrained Supported causes was the rock on which Vic could depend Sadly he died in 61, she mourned him till her end Alexandra, Queen to Edward the Seven follows Vic She was at his side with eight whenever Edward felt sick She was popular and very generous they say And had a strong effect on ladies' fashion of the day Next comes Mary George the Fifth, queen to the royal head. She was nearly George's brother, Albert's wife. Instead, she advised George on his speeches, well versed in history, and was praised by the king at their silver jubilee. For money, heirs, or peace, the monarchs marry. These the British royal consorts chronologically. George the Sixth. Consort Elizabeth is next to sit. She was a charming optimist, blessed with a dry wit. During the German Blitz, she refused to leave London by George's side. Till in 52, the pair became one. Prince Philip, Elizabeth, consort the next we'll see. Four children they had together made their family. Patron to 800 organizations was he, and the longest serving consort in world history. Last comes Camilla, the queen consort to Charles III, once controversial. She had the queen's supports, what I heard. Patron and press to over 100 charities. These are the royal consorts of British history.